This topic's actually more in relationship to a friend, uh, different, you know, perspectives and stuff like this. But basically, there's this idea of a deep state. And, but I wanted to share my opinion about this. So, I think this concept is really uh, profoundly misunderstood because I, I think there's a deep, <laughs> not a pun intended, deep mis misunderstanding of this whole concept, which leads to this perception of a deep state. Okay, for better or worse, in a Republican or a constitutional system, what, what, whatever you want to call it, you want to call it democracy, you want to call it constitutional republic, I don't care. But basically, okay, so this is good and bad because it leads to profound inefficiencies, but the, here's where I believe the concept of the deep state originates. As distinct from pure authoritarian systems where there's no opposition, where basically one side completely overrules the other side. As one side obtains victory, the other side is disposed of, if you know what I mean. In these constitutional republics, here's what happens. So here's what gives rise to the so-called deep state is because there are different interest at odds with one another there are deeply divergent interests so for example um if as one administration takes over even with a majority party uh it's never a monopoly there is so this whole deep state concept is basically based on this idea it, essentially from my perspective there are there are entrenched civil servants, okay? That's fine. Uh, basically, job security, they're civil servants. They can't just be removed by political will. So that's one component where people think about the swamp because they have, you know, these, you know, lifelong civil servants, whatever, whatever. But also, no change of administration is absolute. Uh, the Trump victory did not sweep away, you know, the, the, the blue remnant and a blue wave is not going to sweep away a red remnant so the reason why people in the united states perceive there to be a deep state is because their system isn't an absolute authoritarian system where one where the red completely sweeps away the blue then then you don't have a quote-unquote deep state or the blue completely abolishes the red the red abolishes the blue then you won't have a deep state, quote unquote deep state, because there is no entrenched um, civil, there's no protection for civil servants, there's no in, entrenched bureaucrats. The, the whole concept or phenomenon of a quote unquote deep state is simply, it simply means that there's divergent interest, which also quite frankly leads to a very inefficient and dysfunctional government. And if you think I'm praising the government that that's not correct it, it it absolutely leads to a high level of dysfunction but perceptions of the deep state as this conspiracy i think i think that's flawed i think it's flawed